It's Saturday morning and Maureen Cates has joined up with friends at the Carolina Coliseum. I love Zumba. I really do. Seeing her dance the cha-cha with over a thousand people at Columbia's Zumbathon, you'd never know that eight years ago she almost died. I actually had a heart attack. That whole year I was in and out of the hospital like nine times because the blockage kept back, came back. According to the American Heart Association, heart disease is the number one killer for American women. But 80% of those deaths could have been prevented if those women had simply gotten moving. And here at the Zumbathon in Columbia, that's the goal, to get people moving for a better heart health. Coordinator for the Zumbathon, Tammy Epps, organizes events for Palmetto Heart Health to raise awareness about heart disease and preventative measures. Last year, we were trying to find um, a physical activity um, that would be fun for the community and something really fun to do that would be exciting and be a signature event for our 29 heart, 28 Heart Days campaign. And so as a Zumba instructor myself, I said, we should do Zumba. Seven local instructors took part in the Mega Zumbathon. Cynthia Shepard teaches at USC. She says movement is vital for heart health. And so what we like to say is the more cardio you can do, the better shape your heart will be in. And then the side effect of that is you're going to lose weight as well. So it's a, all around, it's a great picture. For Kate, the choice was simple to get moving, but she finds it offers much more. You, you want to do the best for your body. And when you go into Zumba and you just, for an hour, you just feel free. And you come out and you, your head's clear and you're like, you feel good about yourself. Whether you're young or old, Zumba is a fun way to get moving, and it could save your life. Katie here, Carolina News.